Moo! Welcome back, everybody, to the Ocarina of Time. This is part 11. I'm inside Dodongo's cavern. And I'm coming up to a bridge. Some fire keys. In the last episode, we broke our way into here. We got a heart piece. And we found the map and the compass. Jump! See? Link can jump. Why can't he jump straight up? Guess he's just, uh... I don't know. White man can jump, I guess. Oh boy, yeah, here it is. We were at the room. I hate. I hate this room. Oh crap. Yeah, yeah, I I know. You never know what will be coming around the corner in all these narrow paths. Yeah, use egg targeting. I I'm aware. Okay. Shut up. I can't even skip this. Okay, I I'm aware. I know there are things around the corner. I just got hit with it. So shut up. Anyways. I don't like this room because of this. Damn you. Damn you all to hell. Anyways, the only way is to move this. Whoops. Gotta grab this. Gotta move it out of your way. And climb on top of it. Actually, there's, there's a heart underneath there if you need it. If you need it, and then you can climb up on top of here. Well, you gotta go anyways to get your chest. Because it's got 20 bucks in it. 20 bucks I didn't need. Damn it. Alright, we might have to do some edit here. But, anyways, what you wanna do is try to throw it at the right time. It is possible to land on the ledge, I know. Oh crap. I threw that one way too early. Maybe I was trying to prove you can land it on the ledge. But you can land it on the ledge. I've done it. It's just... It landed on the ledge. It landed on the ledge. You clearly saw that. That was definitely a land... land ledging. Okay? It's not easy. And uh... I'll admit I had a little bit of luck there, but it did land on the ledge. But you know what? Make it easy on yourself and just time it and don't 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 be like me. Brendan? 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 Don't be like me. You see this? There's a cow tattoo. <laughs> got a little home movies there. Has anybody seen that cartoon? That's pretty damn good. Anyways, you got this pit of fire. But as you can see, you got an eyeball. What do you do to an eyeball? You poke it. How can you resist? Whoops. How about you aim correctly? Oh, you pass there. Now this isn't the right room, right? No, it's the next time. Anyway, so I better get going before the fire comes. Mini Dongos! Run for your lives! We're back. Mini boss number two. Here we go again. Oh crap. I'm in the fire. I'm in the fire. That's not what I wanted. Whoa. And now he's spooking me away. Wow, that that did not go well. That did not go well at all. Okay, come on. Come on, dude. Okay, this is going very bad. This is going very bad. So bad that I'm gonna have to embarrass myself and stop for a cold drink of milk. That's how bad this is going. Ah, refreshing cow's milk. Okay, let's not fall in the lava again. Come on, come on! Oh boy, it's the other one. 
Alright, one down. Come on, dude, bring it on! I ain't afraid of you anymore, you hear? I ain't afraid anymore! Yes. There we go. I believe uh, there are some hearts down there. Yeah, there's a heart way down there. Do you really want to go get it? Oh, well, there's a couple. You can see them off in the distance. But you could fall actually to the uh, to the floor below, and it's just well, it's just not worth it. It's just not worth it. Anyways, we got uh, some more fire here. We got here. We go. Shoot it in the eye. Oh boy, what's wrong with my aiming? <laughs> oh, but we got more fire. But the eye is gone. Nope, this is where you turn, this way, yes. You put your double fire out. You come through here. And up here is a nice big treasure chest. What do we got? What's it gonna give us? Ooh boy! I like how the light glows. The shining light. You found the bomb bag. It's made from Dodongo's stomach. Ooh. Twenty bombs are inside that bag. That's just excellent. So now we can blow up things without using bomb flowers. Now there is a door down there, but it doesn't really lead to much. Um, it's it's honestly just not worth it, to tell you the truth. So I'm gonna kind of skip. There, if that's all right with you, I hope it is. So I'm gonna continue on in here. There's just because if you go down there, you gotta go all the way around again, and well, it's just it's just a bitch. Okay, there's just there's there's nothing of value in there. Now, anyways, that made that rise all the way up here. Whoops. So now you kind of have a, a shortcut. Yeah you happen to die. Why am I climbing up on top of this thing? I want to look at the plaque. Giant dead Dodongo. When it sees red, a new way to go will be open. So there's your clue on what to do next. I don't know why. Um, maybe it's because I'm just such a Trekkie. I've always thought of this plaque was kind of like the Enterprise plaque or whatever. That symbolizes each of the ships and talks about it on I don't know that's probably really stupid there anyways um you can come up here and you got your Dodongo there now you're supposed to see you got your eyeballs now with your newfound bombs let's see if I can do this right I might make a total ass of myself but you can just drop the bombs down but I've also discovered that you can whoops it is possible to just land right in the eye itself. Whoops. There's one. You can land right in the eye, and then you can go over. Whoops. Okay, maybe I'm making this harder than it had to be. And land in the other eye, and go like that. And there we go. We have a uh, bow. Oh crap. I forgot something, didn't I? Whoopsie doodle. Damn it. I was one head one step ahead of myself there. <sighs> if this takes too long, I'll cut it. But we gotta take the elevator. Oh no, I thought I was gonna back down first. I I'm aware, Naviv. With that switch on, the platform goes higher. Now you can reach the second floor. Oh, uh, really? Oh crap! Which way do I jump? Oh crap! Anyways, see, so yeah, I was trying to show off how I could jump and in down into the eyeballs, but there's actually something over here. And you blow this up. 
As you can clearly see on your map, there's a treasure chest here. I came back up here for five bucks! Five bucks I didn't need! Oh man, what a waste of time. Alright, we've wasted everybody's time doing that. Yours and mine. Must apologize. Now we can finally get in here. And oh boy, look at that, we're at the skeleton. That means the boss is right behind this door. Hey, get out of my way. So all we have to do is figure out how to open the door. There's a hole here with a switch in it. Which... Come on. Aha, there we go. Alright. Let's go kick some boss ass. Oh no, it couldn't be that simple, could it? Anyways, um, I digress. I shouldn't have... Uh, I shouldn't have been so silly. We all know that it couldn't have been that easy. So anyways, you want to kind of hop up here. Whoops, where am I going? I'm like walking into the wall. This isn't Zelda 1 or even 2 where you can walk through the walls. I don't think there was any in Lincoln Pass, do there? Does anybody know about that? Was there a walkthrough wall in Link to the Past? I can't remember. I don't think there was. Oh yes! Nice shooting there! Oh wow, that was nice. I like that. Hopefully they'll stay off my back. Or I will attack. And you won't like that. Let's grab this one so you can push this one off the ledge. Climb. No, not grab and push. Grip and pull and grip and pull. <laughs> this is completely optional, of course. I don't think you have to go in here. At least not from memory. So I'm probably just wasting more of your time again. Anyways, you can't come over here. You know, I probably didn't even need this to get up here, did I? I probably could. Yeah, I, I didn't even look that much of a big deal. Anyways, I gotta wake him up. Oh boy. Anyways, come on, nope. Come on. There we go. Oh crap. Alright. Now that he's out of the way. There we go, that's what we came for. Gold Skulltilla. Oh crap, that's alright. Oh no, it's gone? Oh, that's... That's a little annoying. Okay, where are you? Oh, you are... You are ticking me off right now. Thank you for the heart, so... But yeah, that you are not being very, very kind to me. Anyways, I'll push this block back down. Anyways, here I am again. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna. Uh, well, I don't have to push this one all the way across. Sorry, I just have to push it enough out of the way. I edited that. Oh, there was a fairy, but it didn't come to me. Come to me, fairy. There we go. Fairy, fairy, give me your answer. Dude. And this is the whole point: is to grab this block, push it down. And then you can push it into the hole. That's what you like to do. Oh, come on, come on, Link! I'll learn about pushing things into a hole sooner or later. Oh, I'm gonna attack! I'm 
Are you gonna attack? Why didn't... Okay. I thought they would just be nice. And leave me alone while I push this block into a hole. But obviously, I was incorrect. Anyways, there we go. And they're in the hole. And in the next episode, I'll kick this bat's ass. And we'll go and meet the boss of this dungeon. So that'll be in the next episode. Until then, move!